Hey guys, welcome back. Today's video is very exciting because I will be unboxing with you the Cult Beauty Gift with Purchase Tried and Tested Goodie Bag. It is this huge bag right here. So how you can get your hands on this is by making a purchase on Cult Beauty website of 150 pounds or more and then you would get this for free. It is valued at around 400 pounds, which is a crazy value. It's got some full sizes, travel sizes, and sample sizes. Last time I checked, this was still available on the Cult Beauty website as I'm filming this video, but of course, by the time maybe I edit it and upload it, maybe it is already sold out. I'm not really sure because these goodie bags do tend to sell out very, very quickly. If you're excited to see what's in this goodie bag, give this video a thumbs up and let's go ahead and hop right into it. So I'm gonna start this video by sharing with you what I got to be able to get the goodie bag for free. But of course, feel free to skip to the part where I unbox the goodie bag. I will leave a timestamp here on the video. Since Call Beauty comes out with the gift with purchase every couple of months, so what I usually tend to do is put some products in my list and then purchase them only when they have the goodie bag available. This way, you know, I'm not just making an impulse purchase because it is a large amount of money. So this time what I had in my list were quite expensive products. Two of them were from uh, the brand Niod, which is a Tessin brand that is extremely expensive. And one of them was from uh, Murad, which is also, again, another very expensive brand. One of the products I picked up from Niod is their Repigment Serum. It is basically a serum targeting pigmentation on the skin, and it's got amazing reviews. So I really, really wanted to try it. It comes in this cute little box. Oh my god. I just dropped it on the floor. Thank God it didn't break. It's right here. I got mine in the 15 ml because I didn't want to invest in the larger bottle. It's very, very expensive. I'm really excited to be trying this out. The second product that I got from Niod is their Survival 30. It is basically an antioxidant blend that has SPF 30. It is a mineral sunscreen and everybody tends to rave about this sunscreen. So I really, really needed to give it a try. It is this guy right here. It does, oh, it comes with a pump, which I really do appreciate. It comes in a really, really cute bottle. It comes in 30 ml, which is really not a large size or a standard size for sunscreens. As usually, they do tend to come in at least 40 ml or generally 50 ml. I'm not really happy about that because this is very, very expensive, but it does have great reviews. So I'm really looking forward to be trying this for you guys in my next episode of Sunscreen Sunday. The third product is also a sunscreen. You know, it's summertime and I definitely need more sunscreen. It is the Murad City Skin Age Defense Broad Spectrum Mineral Sunscreen SPF 50. I've already done a Sunscreen Sunday, which is a full day wear test of this guy on my channel. It should be up by now, but I'm not sure. If it's not, then definitely come back to my channel on Sunday and it should be up. This is a very expensive product. I think it's the most expensive in this haul. It is 60 pounds. But I'm telling you guys, it's amazing. Go check my review or subscribe so you get notified once I upload that review because you're really, really going to enjoy it. And the final product that I got is this edit from Cult Beauty. It's basically a mix of different products for the summer, specifically curated for the summer at a very discounted price. I believe I paid for this 40 pounds, but I'm not gonna share with you the content in this video. I will be doing a separate video where I unbox this. Now let's get into the fun part and unbox the goodie bag. So the goodie bag comes in this cute fabric dust bag. Usually we get this every time there's a goodie bag. It's usually in this color or in like an off-white type of a color. The first item that pops out is this cute little pouch. It says Cult Beauty here and Cult Beauty here. It's made out of cardboard and cotton. 
So this is supposed to be a little bit more um, earth friendly, I believe. Actually, when I initially saw this, I wasn't sure how it would hold up as I thought, you know, it would easily tear since it's cardboard. But honestly, it's quite heavy duty. It feels good quality. It feels sturdy, sturdier than I expected. Next product is, this is a full size product. It is the Gaine Hydrating Face Cream. I'm really excited to be trying out this brand. I haven't tried anything from them, but I heard great things. I have a friend of mine, she's using their face vinegar toner and she swears by that. I believe this brand is all about um, the microbiome and our skin. And I do have a strong feeling that this is going to be the next trend in skincare. It says this is a full size. It is 30 ml. It's definitely on the smaller size when it comes to face creams. Next product is also a full size. It is the Honest Beauty Matte Primer. Now I'm not the biggest fan of matte primers, to be honest, but I can definitely give this away to somebody who would get some use out of it. Next up, we've got a product from Elemis. It is their Skin Nourishing Milk Bath. It comes in 60 ml. Oh my God, I can already smell this. Oh my God, this smells so luxurious. It smells so, so good. I cannot wait to use this. I don't think I'll be using it now in the summer, but this is definitely something I would love to use in the winter. The next product is also a full size. It is by Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk Lip Luster in the shade Pillow Talk. I believe this is like supposed to be a gloss but that's, that has a lot of pigmentation. I think I've tried one of these in the past. So this is a universally flattering shade. It is a very popular shade in the line. So I'll swatch it for you guys. Yeah, it is like a very pigmented gloss. Okay, it smells nice. I can see a lot of people getting a lot of use out of this, especially now in the summer. Next product is by Oskia. It is their Renaissance Nutri Active Brightening and Resurfacing Mask. This is basically like an exfoliating mask. I've received this in the past in quite a few goodie bags. So I have tried this in the past. It's nice. It's not my holy grail, but it's okay. It's a nice mask. Next product is very exciting for me because I always wanted to try this. It is the Emma Hardy Cleansing Balm. So it's quite a small size, but it's definitely enough for me to try. This gets crazy reviews, but it is on the expensive side, and I always have a hard time spending so much money on a cleanser. So I'm excited to be trying this without having to pay for it. Next product is definitely one that we've seen a lot in goodie bags as well. It is the Ren Glycolic Toner. What is it called exactly? Already Steady Glow Daily Age A Tonic. So basically, this is very similar to the Pixie Glow Tonic. I have never tried it, so I'm excited. I do want to try another glycolic acid toner. I tried the one by The Ordinary and I didn't enjoy that at all. Next product, it is by Pi. And look how cute. Really, really cute packaging. It is the Rose Hip Oil. I personally love oils for my skin but I haven't been the biggest fan of rosehip oil. I tried the one from The Ordinary. That one was so thick and heavy, never sank into my skin. So I'm excited to be trying another brand. It is glass and this is quite a decent amount. Next product, we've got Fresh Rose Deep Hydration Face Cream. Oh my God, this is so tiny. We've definitely gotten a lot of fresh products in the past in goodie bags. So it comes in this 7ml top. It's so cute. I've never tried this before. I've tried quite a few products from them, but never their face cream. So that's nice to try. Next product is by Biosense. It is their Squalane plus vitamin C rose oil. I haven't tried anything from Biosense. And actually, this was one of the products that really pushed me into getting this goodie bag because you know Biosense is very expensive 
and honestly I don't want to spend so much money on something that I might end up not really liking so I was really happy to see Biosons in this goodie bag which means I get to try them for free this is how it comes this is a plastic bottle that's okay I was expecting it to be glass but yeah I'm, I'm really excited to be using this I did see great reviews about this product so I'm really happy it came in this goodie bag. Next product, I've received so many of it already as like free gift, gift with purchase, goodie bags. It is the Super Goop Unseen Sunscreen SPF 30. This is basically a chemical sunscreen that is very silicone-y. I think people with dry skin would love this a lot. Sorry, people with oily skin would love this a lot, not dry skin. I personally do not enjoy silicone sunscreens, especially the ones that do feel like they are heavy on silicones. And this one definitely feels like that. I'll show it to you guys. It's a lot. <laughs> I didn't see how much was coming out. Oh my god, that's such a waste. But you guys can see it is like this clear consistency. I'm planning to do like a sunscreen Sunday on this sunscreen. Definitely let me know if you'd like to see that. The next product is also another product that really, really pushed me to get this goodie bag more than the Biosons, and it is the Medicaid C Vetra Vitamin C Serum. This is an 8 ml vitamin C serum. It is very pricey but has amazing reviews. I'm such a sucker for vitamin C. Anytime I see a new vitamin C serum, I just want to try it. And Medicaid has amazing reviews. So I was so excited to see this in this goodie bag. It's such a great sample size. It is decent, 8 ml. I'm definitely looking forward to trying more from Medicaid and hopefully in the future do a review on the brand. Next product is a sample size. It is the Dr. Dennis Gross all physical lightweight wrinkle defense broad spectrum sunscreen SPF 30 so basically it is a mineral sunscreen you get 7 ml in this guy if you know me you know I love sunscreens so I'm always excited to try out new ones and I'll be doing a sunscreen Sunday using this sunscreen so stay tuned for that next product is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Lash Brag Mascara. This is so tiny, you guys. So, so tiny. Look how tiny this is. Wow, I don't know. Maybe you will get like two uses out of this. But it's okay. At least we get to try it. The next product is the Connelly Vino Perfect Complexion Correcting Radiant Serum. I have tried this in the past and I really enjoyed using it. It is basically like a resurfacing or exfoliating serum. I did really, really enjoy it, so I'm glad I got another sample size. Next product, ooh, this smells so strong. It is the Espa Bergamot and Jasmine Body Lotion 30 ml tube. The smell of this is so strong. Oh my gosh. It is sealed and I can smell it. Okay. The scent is really, really strong. I don't think I'll be using this as body lotion, but I'll definitely use it as a hand cream. The next product is also a sample size by It Cosmetics. It's called Hello Results. The writing is so small, I can barely see what's written on it. Wrinkle Reducing Daily Retinol Serum in Cream. Such a long name. So I guess this is like a face cream very very small size so this would probably last like once or twice only i've never tried anything from it cosmetics in the past so i'm glad we've got something from them next product is by one of my favorite makeup brands huda beauty power bullet matte lipstick in the shade dirty 30. she always names her products like funny names such cute packaging i love this formula i already do own one of these lipsticks Okay, the shade is very, very grungy. I'm not sure that I would wear this shade, but I can definitely give it away to somebody who would get some use out of it. And this is a full size. Okay, three more products to go. 
And the next one, it is by Gold Faden MD. And it's basically an eye cream. It's called Bright Eye Star Circles Radiance Concentrate 4 ml. So even though it looks like a sample size, this is quite a decent size for the eye area. I've never tried anything from this brand and I struggle with dark circles, so I'm always on the lookout for something that can help with that. Hasn't been successful so far, but I'm looking forward to be trying this. Next one is by Glow Recipe. It is their Watermelon Glow PHA plus BHA Pore Tight Toner. It comes in a very decent size, 40 ml. Again, this product has amazing reviews. A lot of people tend to like it. That gives me some hope that it's actually a good product. Oh my god, I love the bottle. They do such a good job in, with their packaging. Really, the packaging is so, so cute. It also comes in a glass bottle, which I do appreciate. Final product in this bag is by Sol de Janeiro Rio Sunset Glow Oil. I have tried this in the past. I really, really like it. It is basically like a body oil that gives you a little bit of a glow. The shade it comes in is definitely a shade that I actually really like. So I don't, this is not the full size. I believe this is like a travel size, 30 ml. I will show it to you guys. What I love about this product is that it's not glittery, but it does give you a beautiful, beautiful glow. And the most important part to me is that it's not sticky not sticky at all you guys can see the glow and it dries really fast and smells amazing just like all their products if you know their original scent this smells exactly like that that's it for all the products in the goodie bag this was definitely one of the better goodie bags that they came out with not the best they did have better ones in the past but definitely in their top five i would say I'm really glad I was able to get my hands on one. I also was able to get my hands on the Space NK goodie bag, which I'm waiting for in the mail. It's taking forever for them to ship it out, but hopefully I will get it soon and I will be able to film that for you. So make sure you subscribe so you can see that video once it goes live. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye guys.